sample argumentative essay 1 topic smaller families are better than larger ones argue either for or against the given statement the benefits of living in large families the role of a family is significant in every human life Family is the single most important influence in a child's life. From the very first moments of their life, children depend on their parents and other family members to protect them and provide for all their needs. Despite small families becoming very common these days due to large-scale migration towards cities and metropolis, I would like to argue against the given statement that smaller families are better than larger ones. I personally believe that larger families are definitely better than small or nuclear ones. And I would like to put forth my views as to why I hold this opinion. Well. The system of joint families in our country strengthened during the Vedic age. Joint families are mostly consanguineal family units including two or more generations related through either the paternal or maternal line who maintain a common residence and are subject to common regulations. The mechanism of relationships here is purely based on the foundation of love, support and mutual respect for one another. Living in joint families makes one focus on we rather than me or you. The truth of the age-old proverb, united we stand, divided we fall, is visible here. Togetherness comes with adjustment, compromise, sharing and discipline. And members get to learn the importance of all these virtues since childhood. People here can depend on each other for any kind of help and receive plenty of support during difficult times. Even household chores get shared among the members. Kids brought up with many people are more socially adept and have a wider horizon of education. There's no dearth of company in joint or larger families. Festivals and functions are super fun. They receive a lot of support and guidance from the elders in the family and are more likely to take life decisions wisely and maturely and are less prone to be led astray in life. They know how to communicate effectively with people and express their emotions in a healthy way. Joint families are also cost-effective units. Shared financial responsibilities reduce the burden on everyone. There is hardly any room for a monetary crisis. Even in worst cases of sudden job losses, people are well provided for because the members of a large family can sustain their daily needs together. They look out for each other and support each other in their moments of need. Members of joint families are less likely to suffer from loneliness and depression. There is always someone to hold a hand, extend support, lend a listening ear and show the right path. While the young parents receive the support of the elders in raising kids, the aged parents are dependent on their children for communal, physical and financial support are also assured of a proper living. Ever since the world has been struck by a pandemic, we have seen people sinking into a downward spiral of depression due to isolation, boredom, inability to step outside and so on. Recent surveys and studies have proved that depression, however, has been a rare occurrence 
in joint families during the lockdown. Keeping all these factors in mind, I am of the opinion that larger families are better than smaller ones. Yes, there will be feuds, conflicts and sacrifices. But at the end of the day, one can always overcome pitfalls with love and patience and many shoulders to lean on. Moreover, learning how to deal with conflicts or defend oneself and others or to negotiate and compromise when called upon to do so form the basic building blocks of character development and growth and larger families provide ample opportunity to an individual to build a strong foundation and prosper in life. Thank you. That's all for this video. See you once again in the next video.